Hey guys, so this is another speed painting for me. This is the first time I've used acrylics on this channel, although I have used them before. This is my first time, however, trying to draw people with acrylics. I've never really drawn anything other than still life or landscape with them. So this was an interesting thing for me to try. Now before I get into talking about the picture too much, I just want to bring up something that I find really funny. There are two things that I usually try to avoid at all costs drawing when I draw people. And number one is side profile faces, which I am just the absolute worst at trying to draw because I just like can't get the outline right and it always just ends up looking weird. And the other thing is hands. Like I cannot draw hands at all. Like they're so hard. I have to do them so many times and even like if I do them like 10 times over, like they still don't end up looking right. And so <laughs> the funny thing about this picture is like the two main points of this are like two side profile faces and hands. And so I like why don't we just like try to do like everything that I normally don't do in drawings? So I found that pretty funny, but you know what? This is good practice for me and it's good to like challenge yourself sometimes. So yeah. So this piece is entitled Jealousy and it's for Lemmy a Crescent's contest on emotions. And I chose the emotion Jealousy Envy just because I think it's something that everyone can relate to. It's one of those emotions I think that like everyone feels like at some point and it's just like it can be every day and I just think it's one of the ones that like everyone can relate to and so the purpose of this picture is, is I have two girls here and one of them is upside down and one of them isn't and they both want something that the other one has so the girl who is right set up she wants the other girl's hair that's why she's grabbing at it and then the girl who's upside down, she wants the other girl's eyes just be- and you can see, um, after I move my hand, that she's sort of like grabbing for her eye. And this is just to show that like everyone is jealous of something and ev like it's like not even just certain people like you're jealous of like this girl because she's super pretty and rich. I mean like that means nothing like that girl could be jealous of something like that you have too. So it's like it's something that everyone goes through and so the other thing um here is like i did a lot of the painting in green just because um that's sort of the color always associated with jealousy and envy it's always like green with envy or you know and i also painted um the object of like the desire or the jealousy in green so the one girl's hair is green and the other girl's eye is green and that sort of is to show out that like when you are just so jealous of something that someone else has that it can really like cloud your vision to like actually getting to know that person as them and you just see the thing that you want and so um i did have quite a few difficulties with drawing this picture the first thing was this girl's skin color um like i said i've never tried drawing people with acrylics before and i had a hard time blending um, the skin color with the shadows and everything and even getting the color right um this girl um, who's upside down um it was a lot easier for me to blend the colors in her skin than it was the other girl and i think that's because the other girl's skin is darker and i wanted to give them like different color skins i wanted to show that they were different but um because of that I don't know, it just didn't end up looking right, and it actually ended up lightening her skin color a little bit, but not too much, which I didn't really want to do, but I kind of sort of had to in order to get it to look right. And that was problem number one. Problem number two was um, the hair for both of them. I just was having issues trying to like, get different layers of color in there and trying to get it to look natural and everything and especially um with the girl who's right side up whose hair isn't green with the girl with the green hair it was sort of easier to layer the colors just because i had like a couple different shades of green paint and so that worked well when i tried to shade them together and then i added black and that worked pretty well but with the other girl i wanted to do her hair blonde but it was really hard for me trying to mix the colors that I had to get like a blonde color and then trying to get 
a lighter yellow and then like a darker brown and so like the hair was just looking like not like hair it was just looking like one solid like blob of color which I wasn't really liking too much and so I had to experiment with that a lot I had to let it dry and then repaint it over and then try to like get the streakiness in of hair and so that was it I also went back and forth for a while trying to figure out what color I wanted to make their clothes I mean it doesn't matter a ton just because there's not like much of it shown at all and I did like I went back and forth with whether or not I wanted to be the same color or different colors but I then decided in the end to make them the same color just because um it shows that like even though like you're like jealous of something another person has like everyone is the same basically and so it was sort of I wanted symbolism in that sense the other thing is is it was hard for me just because the faces were just not looking right at all until I went in um, at the end with like a, a sharpie and then filled in like the eyelashes and the eyebrows and the mouth and stuff and so it was really hard for me to like the picture until that happened and um, I also like wanted to put in line art and I knew I wanted to do that after I painted the acrylics just because I knew if I did it beforehand I would like it would just paint over it anyway and so I debated about whether like what color I should do for that I didn't want to do just a plain black and so I actually ended up doing as you'll see is using a silver gel pen to do the line art and I actually ended up really liking that because it sort of makes it pop and then I did some detailing with the girl's green hair um, with the silver too and then I did use some white in the blonde girl's hair and I think that sort of helped it more and the other thing is I had to cut out a lot of this part but I went in and did sort of like a squiggly background on top of the green that I did um, just because the background as it is right now just looked kind of boring to me and I wanted to add some sort of like other dimension to it and so I did that but unfortunately my camera started tilting down in a weird angle and it cut off a lot of what I was doing at that time and so um, the video is almost ending so I'm gonna get to um, why I actually want to win the prize although it will be in the description below as, as well so painting is something that I've just recently gotten into I really really love it acrylics and watercolors and both of those are just really fun and I like experimenting around with them. But I don't have a really good brush set right now and I would love to win because it would let me to experiment more with painting and just getting to have a high quality brush set I think would really help with that. And so yeah, the video is almost over and here is the finished piece. I hope you liked it. Um, subscribe for more if you like my videos and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye!